Well, that's a problem. My son just showed up. He doesn't really know the horses, and Chino just walked up to him. Too much for him being a guard horse, you guys. <laughs> Penny's still back there. I have high hopes for Penny. Good morning guys welcome to today's video like i just said my son showed up and he just walked into the field because chino hasn't he hasn't been here since chino's been here and he loves chino and chino apparently loves him and so does molly because he's just <laughs> throwing the cone for molly i don't like to leave him in the field i'll bring him a carrot some people just really even when they don't spend a lot of time with horses they get like that energy and that healing peace from them and i can see nick getting peace and love from him the best. Hey, it's Nick. He's like, don't worry, I'll get it. I thought he'd be like a guard horse, like, ah, there's a stranger in the paddock and come galloping because he gallops. He remembers me. Yeah. He's like, oh, it's just you. He's happy to be home. Holy moly. I bet. He loves it here. Uh, yeah, yeah, just eating and drinking and riding. Now he gets all four girls all to himself. Girlfriends, eh? Yeah, every time they come in to heat, he changes which one's his favorite. Missed it, but Ruby was just sitting right beside Honey. And I was like, you know, I swear to God, even Ruby thinks this foal is her baby. Like, she just loves her so much. <laughs> She's so cute. <laughs> See how cute she is? <laughs> jump, run and jump over that jump. Run, run, jump, jump. <laughs> she has you well trained. <laughs> Apparently, Chino walks to anybody. Yeah, you got it. And then after it's over his ears. Then clip that. Just clip it to there. Yep. Now watch, my horse will probably run. Aww. <laughs> That's adorable. She's exploring. She doesn't jump. We don't let her jump. But she's exploring. Her and her mama there. Her mama's like, don't do it, baby. Don't do it. We take our horses on a little ride. Last night, Sophie came down to put Honey in her stall for dinner. And Honey was at the back of the field and she saw Sophie and she made this big, huge whinny. And then she ran bucking to Sophie. She ran bucking to him. Sophie's like heart melted. She's like, oh, you're so cute. She was so excited to come in for dinner. You ready, Miss, Miss Molly? It sucks that Penny is missing part of her eyelids because it makes it so that she can't close her eyes all the way. And somebody asked me the other day if she had an eye infection. She doesn't have an eye infection. It's just that her eye, she rubbed her, something happened. She's missing pieces of her eyelid. She was like that before we got her. And um, it makes it so that she can't completely close her eyes. So on really windy days and like dusty days and stuff, stuff blows in her eyes and then they get runny. And it just sucks. Look how beautiful. <laughs> Look how beautiful my horse looks. She's wearing green. She's wearing green and she's wearing English. Mom, everyone's having a nap and guess where Honey is. Yeah, where's Honey? Right next to me. Yeah, Honey is really coming into herself. When we first got her, she was like nervous and shy because she doesn't know anybody, which now she's like slowly, the more she fits in with the herd, the more she's like, I am the boss of you. <laughs> we have to say, no, you're not. She's getting fun now, like really fun, super cute. We love being able to like correct her and make her listen and show her the ropes and the rules because the horses are really not. <laughs> You're supposed to be doing a much better job, Gracie. Oddly, we still have not emptied the trailer. I think it's because we, oh, because we went for a ride on the weekend, but I haven't emptied my stuff. And essentially, my son showed up with a friend and they want to ride. My boys never show up and are like, hey, can we ride? ever they're not like horse people but nick my youngest son you guys remember he rode sabrina when we had our first lease horse he likes to ride every once in a while he like he enjoys it and now that chino's home and i think he's been waiting all this time for chino to come home i literally cannot find my rope halter 
Oh, I have two. Why can't I find either? Let's go. I'll find one is on. You're only 26. <laughs> no. Gabby's, yeah, Gabby's like, Gabby's not the one that, well, actually, she's usually good. All right, we're getting ready to roll. <sighs> you have to have reins on your horse. Right. So, Nick's friend's gonna ride Penny. It's okay. All right, Penny, you be good, because normally Penny's not as good as she is on the trail as she is at home. Straight off, wrong side, you can't get on down the hill. The ladder's right here. All right, move it down there. On this side to get on. So I put this holy heck strap. I put this. I made Sophie put this holy heck. No, I said, what if I put this? And you're like, yeah, put that. Yeah, so that's true. Right, okay. <laughs> so I thought that that would be sufficient, but then Sophie's like, no, she needs reins. So Penny's out here. I got her on the lead rope, but <sighs> Nick's girlfriend loves her. Loves her. You love her? Yes. Yeah, she's like such a fun horse. She's like, this is fun. Because you know, she's not a boring horse. She doesn't just like. No. What? Yeah. All right, come on. She's mad because she knows eating grass. She's not a, a slow horse. She like moves. So it makes it fun. All right, hold on. Best beginner horse ever, man. Would you believe that when I bought her, somebody said, someone really kind said, I'm afraid she's going to kill you. You need to get a really good bit. And here she is, two years later, and she's, hey, don't let her pull her up a bit. And she's just living it. She's just doing it. You want to go again? Sure. Okay, let's go this way. Just a little walk, Pen. Yeah, it's okay. You're a good girl. This is actually fun for me, getting to see other people enjoy her. Like, I love other people enjoying my horse. Are you scared? No, she's fast. She's fast. Like, she's no pokey little horse. Good girl. She's going. She's got the reins. Do you love going down a hill? Yeah. You just lean back a little and she is so sure-footed. Such a good girl. She's just going where she wants. <laughs> Which is home. <laughs> home, James. And she's writing English and I think she really likes it. I know she's dusty. Good girl. Okay, so that was interesting. You guys know how she always like does that little bucking thing when I ask her to ride? She didn't do that today. And everything was the same except for the rider and except for the saddle. And that makes me wonder. So Penny does fit Stella's old saddle. So maybe I'll Maybe I'll clean that up and use it and try her, ride her at home a couple of times with that saddle because she loved that actually. She seemed happy enough to go out there and just wander around. Another thing that's weird is that my son is like such a good mom. He's like such a, he's so much like me, it's insane. And he's like so caring and, and he's out there with Chino right now taking him out to the field and he wants to like, take care of all the stuff and he decided not to ride Chino because he was worried it was too heavy for him. And Gabby doesn't like people riding her horse so it worked out okay. <laughs> I got a package, two packages actually. Plus they have one big box and then one little box on the inside. All right, so this is what we got. Looks like, looks like bottle caps. There we go, you guys. These are all for the saddle pads. We're gonna go down in just a few minutes. The girls are having lunch and then we're gonna go down and try it out, try them out. But I think they're gonna work. So this is how they work. And hopefully it's gonna be amazing. Okay, now, isn't that the most beautiful horse you ever saw? Oh, you ruined it. Oh, 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 you did it, you did it. That was a big apple. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You're ruining it because you, Pet her, pet her. So the, the, the trick here is that if your horse is laying down, if you walk up to them and give them a treat and then you can pet them. You can sit with them. You can sit with them, but it, I didn't clean the poop out of the field yet today. So there's 
poop in the field. That is why I clean the poop out of the field. Get right down there with her, Sophie. I don't want to down. Well, just like squat down. Crouch, Crouch down. Like, oh my goodness, she looks so cute. With the, like, yeah, do it again. Willow's like, oh, now you want Gracie too? Is it just a Palomino thing? Willow's a little jealous. That is beautiful. So that is what you're supposed to do. Teach them like that it's safe. I don't have arms. And it's over. So you may or may not see, but there is a bar up there. I do not like it up there, but that's where Sam wanted to put it. And somebody suggested like, how the heck are you gonna get the saddle pad down? I don't know. The thing is, when you're dealing with men, saddle pad. <laughs> when you're dealing with men, you just kind of go with the flow. That's what I've learned. Because I didn't used to. All right, I'll bring the saddle pads over. It's gonna be cute though. Like all these beautiful colors. I wanna display them. And we have a lot. I don't think we're gonna have enough clips, to be honest. So we might just like hang up our most beautiful ones. Uh, just wait, I'm uh, Whoa, 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 wait a second. We're kind of doing it wrong. Like everybody's doing it their own way. Yeah, my way might help us. Basically, we are going to just get as many up as we can and then we'll show you. All right, so Sam was right. He got it good. I love it. I love where it is. This is my section over here. I have a pink one and then I have... I say we come down in the morning and they're all gone. And then I have this purple one that was Sabrina. And the reason I like that one is because it is really super thick and I think that if I'm gonna ride her English at all that that would be better but I had more than one saddle pad English saddle pad didn't I uh, no, yeah, you one. One. I have a pink Lemieux one don't I no no dad gave you a burnt orange one and you didn't like it and I took it <laughs> Did you well, give me one? In... You gave me it. You said, here you go. Yeah, I hated that you sucker. And I have. I've had people offer to buy that from me too. Because it's like so sought after because you can't get them. Don't it. It's this one. I'm taking it. Yeah, I, know. I think I should get a pink one in exchange. No, you were ungrateful. <laughs> So before anybody like goes in and is like, oh, your kids are so rude. I value that in my kids. I value them having a voice and speaking and being able to say what they think, especially when it makes me laugh. It's true. I was rude. I was ungrateful. I wanted a Lemieux saddle pad. I wanted a pink one so bad and they didn't have it. So he bought me burnt orange as a surprise. And honestly, why are you taking yours down now? Yeah. No, they look fine. No. Oh. Oh my gosh. Who knew it was gonna be this much trouble? Oh. Me. I knew. Willow's little tiny saddle pads. Mine are up there and they're happy. Other people yeah, Willow's you. little tiny saddle pad. I could go and steal minutes with the mini. Or clean up poo. I'm gonna clean up poo and then I'll come back when they're done and show you the saddle pad. All right, I'm gonna do a test. We're not done yet. Oh, we're not done yet? But you guys both have them separate, different ways. I like the spine out better. Well, boo hoo. <laughs> but in our family, we are our own creative selves. We do it our own way. So I just want them to be happy with their own choice and I want them to learn to make their own choices. Do we have enough hooks for those ones? Yes. All right, so Gabby said that these ones are too thick. Why don't you want to hang that beautiful red one up though? Too thick. Oh, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna maybe move them over here. So these are all the ones that we have left, which are like mostly specific ones. Where's the... We still have a ton over at the other barn, actually. All right, so that is it. That's it for now. All right, I do not know how many saddle pads we have. And they're not all hung up. We have some more at the other barn. We have a bunch of clips left. And then we have like a bunch. I didn't put this one on, so you can't blame me for that. And then we, are you going to hang up Willow's little baby one? Well, yeah. All right, hang that one up. 
These ones are kind of heavy. These are show pads. So I'm going to save the rest of these hooks. We have quite a few left actually. And I'm going to find a way to hang up the heavier ones. And like this one is not very big. It's like a non-slip pad. I like that though. And it, the, there's a few over here that were too big, too thick. I might hang them up, hang them in my section because I have no problem hanging up thick ones. Me either. I like it though. All right, let's take one last look. All right, that's it. They hung them up their own way. I believe in that. Yeah, you can hang pennies or penny and honey is too complicated. I say perfect for I say penny for every time I mean honey. Yeah, go ahead, hang up her blankets. I love it though. I love it. I love it. So much better. It's so much cozier. Comment below. Until if you sitting, do something until you're sitting here and they're all following your head. Yeah, that would be interesting. Comment below if this is how you do it or if you do it a different way. And comment how many saddle pads you have because I feel like we don't really need this many. But I'm I feel glad like we have not enough. Yeah. Don't you know that you're beautiful?